Hi guys, so it's the end of day 8, which was a very short day, I only have 25 kilometers on the clock and uh, 4 hours. Now the reason for that is I'm really adapting to mountains, I'm from Paris, so it's not easy training for climbing up and down there, and I don't have uh, long, long climbs, um, so I'm really not my muscles are not ready for that, so today is really an adaptation day. Now, my legs are really suffering, you see? These legs, this part, they're the ones that hold this together. The knees are suffering a lot on the way down, and these parts are really pulling me up, and on the way down there, you know, uh, I have to run like that. Really, all the time, pay attention. So it is really a hard job because one mistake and you fall and you break something and you can be sure of that you you will break something you will destroy yourself if you don't pay attention so it is a very very intense running job in the mountains you see how the roads are here this this is quite technical it look it may look simple that there's a lot of rocks it's quite wet here it's been raining to today and yesterday and the whole night so lots of water, so running on this, it really goes like this, you know, you're watching always here, there, here, there, you go like that, you always watch, always very intensely, and every time you place your foot somewhere, you're doing it on purpose, you have to do it on purpose, very precisely, you see, so stones are wet, they are slippery, there are different types of vegetation that are slippery too, so you have to know very well how to do that. So that's, that's why it's really not easy actually and my muscles are burning now, they're on fire, you know, so I, I'm pretty sure I didn't uh, break anything because I would feel it, it's very different as a feeling, but I have to pay attention because trying to push it too fast, too hard, you, you might pull something, you know. And that's what I want to avoid. I want to last a long time, so I'd rather go slowly, not run too much. And that's what happened this morning. I tried to wake up and go on early on a 50 kilometer path, which I will do tomorrow. But uh, I realized uh, after doing everything that I was just too tired. I hadn't had enough rest, although I had slept eight hours. But my legs hadn't recovered entirely, and they still haven't. So. Even in the morning, I, I started with with my muscle burning, my muscles burning, and it was painful. And tomorrow it will be the same. I will start the day, and I will already feel all of that. It will make it harder, actually. But that's my muscles adapting. So that's it. Uh, that's the reason for today. I I've avoided the rain. The, the landscapes were wonderful. I hope you got the pictures. I hope you'll see it in the run laps. And. Uh, Man, this, this is why I love running and this kind of thing. You get to places where no one gets, except if you hike. But hiking, you don't do that, you don't cover that much distance, you know? So, today I had a big climb of 1000 meters, and it was really hard for me, and I had lots of technical problems with the camera and other stuff. So, it was really slow, really painful. I really had to, you know, take my time. And, anyway, it has been worked out so tomorrow big day and we'll see how my muscles hold up but there's a funny thing about mosquitoes here and which is that basically when you're running uh, you go a little bit too fast and you're too shaky so they can't they can sit on you you know but whenever you stop or you slow down enough they you become a prey yeah they all gather around you and there's a lot of mosquitoes around here it's quite wet there's lots of places for them it's the forest so this is the kind of thing that actually is an advantage when you're a runner over a hiker when you're a hiker you walk usually slow slowly enough for mosquitoes to catch up with you and find a place but when you run except on the ways up or when you're really slow it's actually great so that was one of the small details of the run. So thanks you thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this update. Please tell me if you want me to change something. And I uh, see you soon.